hi guys welcome back to my space so today's video so today's video i would like to share with you a nigerian first time in ghana her experience and the question she asked before going to ghana is that are ghanaians friendly as and uh, it has been surfaced online that ghanaians are friendly they are lovely people they welcome people with their hearts so she went to ghana to experience it herself let's watch the video and see if truly ghanaians really welcome her because a lot of people also have misconception about ghanaians how they behave i come from ghana and I love sharing content concerning Ghana, which is my country. So if you are interested in content like Ghana, want to know more about Ghana, then keep watching this space. So guys, let's go and watch the video yourself. If truly Ghanaians are really friendly or they are not. And So our plane landed in Ghana and I was telling my husband, I'm like, why did I feel so hot? We went outside. It was beautiful. Like, I just felt like home. It was a lot of people, it was people selling things, people buying things, people talking, it was so loud. Is it only in Ghana that people sell on traffic or some african countries too people sell on traffic or at the roadside let me know from you so we took a ride from accra to cape coast and technically this ride was supposed to be about two hours long but <laughs> that was not the case the ride took about four to five hours the rush hour was just huge i'm telling you my dear i fell asleep and woke up and we were still in the same rush hour <laughs> first night in Ghana it was just it was so hot it was like an African slapping me on the face just like welcome to Africa kind of thing Ghana is a country of fufu kinky and watchy so i was so anxious to try all those food you get to see fufu how it's made fresh and how they bring it to you there's it's a different way of the way i love it i mean i really really love it let's talk about the people of ghana first of all i was very nervous about going to ghana because i've never been to ghana be before but people were so very welcome. They are very open-minded. They greet you in the morning, they greet you in the afternoon, when they see you again in the evening. They what I also want to add is that we're here to change the bad narrative of Ghana or Africa as a whole if you want to explore one country um one thing you have to notice is that the people are so different from where you come from because every country they have different attitude different people <clears throat> and the weather in ghana too is very hot very, ghana is very very hot so if you are a type you don't like hot weather or you like we hot weather you can have a night and um, you may also meet bad people on your way. It doesn't mean that um, all the people are the same. And you may also meet good people on your way. It doesn't mean that everybody is also like that. But one thing is you just have to explore and be happy. You go with good mindset and you are going to enjoy Ghana. I'm here to share with you some of the things um, people like about my country, Ghana, 
and some of the things I also like about my country, Ghana. So, um, I once shared with you on this channel that um, Ghanaians really value their culture, and one of their culture is greetings. Ghanaians really like greetings. They love to greet you wherever they meet you, being if they know you or they don't know you and their food too, they don't joke with their food. And she also mentioned about that, which is <clears throat> Fufu and Kenke and Wache and, you know, they eat with their hands as well. And, you know, in public too, you don't have to show um, your left hand eating. You can eat alone with your left hand in your house. But when you are eating with people in public, they will not really accept you to eat with them with your left hand. This is one of also their culture. So if you want to visit Ghana, you have to learn all these things. It's not by force to to eat with your, your right hand. But if you are a lefty, people will not allow you to eat with them with the left hand. It could be people may allow you when they are your family members. But if you don't know them, and maybe you meet outside and you guys are having to get together or something like that. You have to show your right hand. These are some of the things you may also experience in Ghana. And you feel like people are discriminating against you because you are using your left hand. But not the case. You may also explain to them that, yes, I am this. And, you know, they may understand you. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like, comment, and share. And I'll come again with another content. I'll still be sharing with you some of the things I feel like I want to share with you from Ghana and from people who have experienced Ghana before and the good things that Ghanaian governments are doing. So if you are interested in content about Ghana, Keep watching this piece and I'll come again with another content. Bye-bye.